Hi, this is my weekly check-in in regards to my diet. So as of today, I am down exactly 30 pounds. But what that means though is last week I was at 294 and this week I am at 291. So this past week I only lost three pounds where last month I was averaging over six and a half pounds a week which is to be expected. I kind of figured that that first month I would shed pounds really quickly, but I'm sticking to the same routine. I am doing low carb, pretty much very low carb, and then intermittent fasting every day as well. So I try and have my last meal or food be around 5.30, and then I won't eat until 9.30 the next day. So I just want to give a quick update on that. I am now 30 pounds down, so at 2.91 and my goal is 220 or better. So I'm on my way. So more than a quarter of a way there, which is great. One thing my wife suggested was to do a, I call it a cheat meal. She says I should do a celebration meal. I really like eating out and I like sushi, burritos, seafood. So she's like, have a celebration meal. You lost 30 pounds. I might do a couple of videos on what my cheat meals are. I probably won't do that at this point because I still want to be shedding quickly. Tune in for maybe some shorts here and there when I show you what my cheat meals are. I will probably either try and go to a restaurant that I've never been to before or have a meal that I've never had before. But I want to, for the last part of the video, just show off what's kind of helped me this week. And the first thing I'll show is just, this is from Costco. It's uh, Italian dry salami. So as you can see, this is a, a very low carb meal. But what I sometimes add to it is it's red chili pepper spread. I love things that are, you get savory and sweet and you combine those together. So I will actually put some of this on salami if I, if I don't feel like doing cheese. There is more carbs than I would like in this, but it's still not too much. You really don't need a lot. I mean, this has a ton of flavor in it. And the other thing I've been using is Waterloo. It doesn't use any sugar substitutes or anything like that. Me personally, I do not care for sparkling water. So it, it's taken me a little while to get used to it. At least it's not too much of a sparkling water thing. So honestly, I often prefer, instead of something like Waterloo, that I prefer an ice drink or Costco's Kirkland brand version of that ice drink. But those you know, have zero carbs as well, but they do have sugar substitute where this is all natural. So these are my three things that have helped me out this past week. Again, I was a little disappointed in only losing that three pounds this past week, but it's also understandable and I'm glad I'm still losing. I'm down 30 pounds total. Hope to just continue that on and I will try and keep updating weekly and we'll see how it goes. Catch you later.